Jason Brown, accused of shooting and killing Southport police officer Oren Allen, appears in his first court date, Wednesday, August 9, 2017. Robert Skier forward slash Indistar. Aaron Allen Southport Police Lieutenant. Aaron Allen, photo, provided by IMPD, provided by IMPD. Southport Police Department Lieutenant. Aaron Allen was wearing a body camera that captured the July the 27th moment he was shot to death while helping a motorist in an overturned vehicle. The video will not be viewed by the public before the man accused of Allen's murder, Jason Dane Brown, goes on trial, Marion Superior Judge Sheila Carlisle ruled. If convicted, Brown faces a possible death penalty. Related, change of venue requested for trial of Jason Brown, accused of killing Southport officer. Related, suspect in fatal shooting of Southport Lieutenant. Aaron Allen released from hospital. Related, prosecutor will seek death penalty in senseless killing of Southport police officer. Brown, 28, crashed a car in the 6600 block of South Madison Avenue in Homecroft on the afternoon of July 27. He was upside down and belted into the seat of the overturned car when Allen crawled through a window to help. That is when Brown, prosecutors say, fired more than a dozen shots. Allen was struck in both arms, the right leg, upper back, abdomen and heart as he tried to crawl away. He died less than an hour later at Eskizi Hospital. The motive behind the shooting remains unclear. Brown also faces a possession of marijuana charge in connection to the incident. Deputy Prosecutor Jason McGrath revealed in court documents filed in September that Allen's body camera recorded his final moments. Jason Brown, 28, photo, IMPD. The state believes the body camera footage referenced above will be admitted as evidence in this case, McGrath said in a September. 25 request that the footage be kept private. Any dissemination of the footage prior to trial, to the media or third parties, McGrath wrote, would gravely diminish the defendant's opportunity for a fair trial anywhere. The judge agreed, issuing a protective order that allows Brown's attorney, Denise Turner, one copy of the video under strict caveats. Turner declined Indistar's request for an interview. Jason Brown heads to court Wednesday, August. 9, 2017, about two weeks after he was accused of shooting and killing Southport Police Lieutenant. Aaron Allen, photo, Robert Skier forward slash Indistar. In another behind-the-scenes court battle, Turner is fighting the prosecutor's request that the judge order Eskizi Hospital to hand over Brown's medical records. Turner, in court documents noted the state seems especially interested in blood tests that might show whether Brown was under the influence of drugs or alcohol on the day Allen was shot. In a motion filed on November 29, Turner said that the while records of drug or alcohol use on the date of the incident may arguably be relevant, other records are not relevant. The state's request, Turner wrote, amounts to nothing more than a fishing expedition into otherwise privileged information. In the state's response filed December 6, Deputy Prosecutor Christina Gull said the state is looking for symptoms of brain injury or other trauma that might not have been present until days after the crash and shooting. The state would argue that this information is extraordinarily relevant as the potential for injuries to affect any behavior or actions of the defendant, Gull wrote.